up, ooh wee! You know who it is, it's Pickle Rick coming to you from CaptionCon. And today we're asking cosplayers what's the most they ever spent on a cosplay. <laughs> Me, personally, I think the most I ever spent was like 80. Or maybe more, I can't remember. I gotta check my bank account. But right now, it's not about me. We got another green person. This one right here. How you doing? Hi, I'm great. Okay, so how much have you ever spent on a cosplay? I would say almost $600. That's more than my car payment. You have a car payment? Yes. Wow. That's more than my rent. Where do you live that your rent's less than six hundred dollars? Like still in my parents' house. I still live in my parents' house. In the basement. And he doesn't even have a basement, so that's even worse. I live underground. I had to I had to dig it out myself. This is sad. Right? Well, I'm gonna let you take the mic, have fun. Do 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 uh, no, I don't want to be there. No, I don't want to be there. <laughs> and <laughs> what was the cosplay? And uh, oh yeah. Oh. Okay, it was when I first started cosplaying, and I didn't know how to sew or anything, and so I commissioned like a hero Deku suit like a long time ago, and um, someone like I say it was six hundred dollars because. I got scammed by a commissioner, so I had to recommission it with someone else, and then it ended up being like $600 altogether. It was really sad. I cry a thousand times, but... Don't worry, life is worse. I know. So, uh, if, we, if, you, if you happen to find this scammer, we got your back. Yeah. So, I'm here with the ultimate despair. <laughs> <laughs> so, what would be the most you ever spent on a cosplay? Um, well, when I was getting uh, Snow Miku, it was like I had to do a lot of chores for weeks to pay that uh, money <laughs> for that cosplay, and it paid off. Oh, oh. despair. <laughs> it paid. It paid off quite, uh, quite much. <laughs> it wasn't worth it. Yes, very much. The cosplay is always worth it. Uh, Amazon's my friend, so my costumes usually don't go over like maybe fifty dollars, which is yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, the most ever spent on a cosplay is actually not the one I'm wearing, despite that like how big it is. A uh, very similar one um, came out to about eight hundred dollars. Um, it was actually a Toho cosplay. I was doing a uh, Komaju Densetsu Ron, so I had the same kind of rig, the same amount of fur, um, but I actually I bought like real leather to use for a bunch of belts and to use for some cuffs. Um, that added up pretty quick. And then I actually had to buy an air compressor because I was doing uh, airbrushing. So I had to buy a whole new set of tools, break one, buy another one. So it, I mean, I used it on other costumes after that, but it was like the most I spent to like finish a build in its entirety, so. I feel like what makes it expensive is getting the contacts and the wigs. Um, I would say I would. I, I feel like it all adds up to at least a hundred. But I did. I did buy her this costume um, for Christmas, which was about eighty, almost eighty-five dollars, and then adding the wig and the foam. So I would say a hundred dollars for a cosplay. What about you? You've got a lot of money in my costume. Yes. Um, I think mine would probably be my Astolfo that I did for my first ever animacement, actually, in Raleigh. Um, it was my first, like, armor build. I had a cape. I bought a very specific wig for him. I bought a sword for him. It was probably, like, $130. Yeah. Um, and I wish I had spent more because I bought black boots, and I just painted them white thinking, like, oh, that's going to stay, which in Raleigh during the summer does not. It will melt right off. So, yeah, that's the most I spent. <laughs> EVA foam um, and also hot glue. Those two alone, just using like say materials left and right, it, it just spends a lot of money. It's, it like it builds up over time. And uh, same thing like with uh, fabric cloth. When you're working with that, you know, you try to be as meticulous as you can about that. But uh, cosplay that would be doing uh, Hades from uh, from uh, Final Fantasy 14. That's right. We're looking over a thousand. And that includes like say wiring, LEDs, everything with that. Okay. <laughs> so 
My uh, most expensive cosplay would probably have to be my Stalker from Stalker Shadow of Chernobyl cosplay. Because the Russian mountain suit, the gas mask, the rifle, the plate carrier and the vest, all that cost way a lot of money. And I'd have to say it was probably around 500 to $600 for that. But it's probably one of my favorite cosplays, even if it does get pretty hot. Alright, so technically this one was like 400 500 It was like, I literally had to 3D print this. Plus there was the kneecap here, which was extra filament for like the 3D printer. Then the cosplay, then the hair, then the face paint, then the shoes. Everything here was like around like 400 500 Was it worth it? Yes. That's all that matters. All right, there's a lot of cute, cute NDA cosplayers I was trying to Uh-oh, hit my boy up. And my boy Nova Cosplays, you know what it is. Two S's. 500, 600, I don't know. <laughs> and what was the cosplay? I did a Sailor Bell, which is like a mashup of Sailor Moon and Disney's Bell. That was a lot of fabric. Um, this crop. Mm. Um, Was it worth it though? It was. It's my favorite favorite cosplay to this day. Nice.